Welcome back to the first season of Corey Reed Reads. Now, I've been read Goodbye Geese and The Night Parade already. And now it's time to read the third and final book is Guess How Much I Love You. This is a story about nut brown hairs. It's a different type of bunny. Okay, they love them so very much. How do you know? You gotta read it and find out. Let's get started anyway. Guess How Much I Love You by Sam McBratney, illustrated by Nita Jerome. Like I said, it's kinda hard for me to turn that page, but don't judge me. Little Nut Brown Hair, who was going to bed, held on tight to Big Nut Brown's hair's very long ears. He wanted to be sure that Big Nut Brown hair was listening. Guess how much I love you, he said. I don't think I can guess that, said Big Nut Brown hair. This much, said Little Nut Brown hair, stretching out his arms as wide as they could go. Big Nut Brown hair had even longer arms, but I love you this much, he said. Hmm. That is a lot, thought Little Not Brown Hair. I love you as I can, high as I can reach, said Little Not Brown Hair. I love you as high as I can reach, said Big Not Brown Hair. That is very high, thought Little Not Brown Hair. I wish I had arms like that. Then Little Not Brown Hair had a good idea. He tumbled upside down and reached up the tree trunk with his feet. I love you all the way up to my toes. He said, and I love you all the way up to your toes, said Big Nut Brown Hair, swinging him up, up over his head. I love you as high as I can hop, laughed Little Nut Brown Hair, bouncing up and down. I love, But I love you as high as I can hop, smiled Big Nut Brown Hair, and he hopped so high that his ears touched the branches above. That's good hopping, thought Little Nut Brown Hair. I wish I could hop like that. I love you all the way down to down the lane as far as the river, cried Little Nut Brown Hair. I love you across the river and over the hills, said Big Nut Brown Hair. That's far, very far, thought Little Nut Brown Hair. He was almost too sleepy to think anymore. Then he looked beyond the thorn bushes, out into the big dark night. Nothing could be farther than the sky. I love you right up to the moon, he said, and closed his eyes. Oh, that's far, said Big Nut Brown Hair. That is very, very far. Big Nut Brown Hair settled Little Nut Brown Hair into his bed of leaves. He leaned over and kissed him goodnight. Then he lay down close by and whispered with a smile, I love you right up to the moon. And back. The end. That was an amazing book. My advice is to love yourself instead of loving each other. And love each other also. But love yourself. That's my advice. And I cannot wait to recap all three books for today. And I'm going to do it when the first season of Corey Reed Reads continues right after this.